going on everybody this is dk dynamite and today we're going to be focusing on all the secret rooms here within dead of the night now we're going to begin with my favorite room which is the one in billiards now i've seen a couple of people make videos about this one and no one's really touched on exactly how to open this room every single time 100 guaranteed now all you have to do is pocket all of the balls in the order of one through nine in one pocket now if you were to pocket all of the balls in the order of one through nine in a bunch of random pockets then you'd simply be given a bonus points power up it will not open up the room and i've seen a couple of people misinterpret that reward into thinking that it's rng if you pocket the balls in the order of one through nine it'll either give you a power up or open up the secret room and that is not the case there is simply three different outcomes with this pool table if you were to pocket all of the balls in a random order so let's say two six one five it'll just give you a grenade at the very end once you pocket the last ball but once again if you pocket all of the balls in one pocket in the order of one through nine you'll always open up the secret room now it's a little disappointing to see that you're pretty much always going to be given a very basic weapon or possibly even a random pickup from this secret room it would have been really cool to see this secret room as a part of maybe the side quest for the nx shadow claw or even the steak knife but unfortunately it's just a random reward nothing too special now moving on to another secret room which is the bookshelf here in the library this one's pretty obvious you have to go up to the book with the shield emblem on it and simply shield bash that book and it'll open it up giving you a part for the wonder weapon upgrade also known as the chaos theory or tier two of alistair's foley now moving on to the bookshelves in the east and west balcony respectively so people are also misinterpreting how this little side quest works so essentially there's going to be two books on the east bookshelf and two books on the west bookshelf each book has a certain and symbol on them essentially it's a zodiac symbol for the seasons from what i understand and all you have to do is interact with these books in the order of spring summer autumn and winter now this is the interesting part the shelf that opens up in your game will be dependent on wherever the final symbol which is winter spawns so you're only going to have either the west or the east bookshelf open up in your game so i'll show two examples on screen one example where the winter book spawned in the west bookshelf and another example where the winter book spawned on the east bookshelf so once you put that in order the bookshelf will open up and will once again give you a pretty disappointing reward which is going to be a weapon a power up a point drop whatever that may be and that is it some people on Online are really confusing this side quest and saying that you could open up both shelves or that something else is going on but this is the case only one bookshelf will open in a single game of dead of the night now moving on to the final secret room which is located in the wine cellar this is going to consist of you knifing the leaking wine barrels in the order of the fastest leaks to the slowest leaks now there's going to be six leaking wine barrels and you have to pay close attention to how fast or slow the the wine is leaking from each of them so i would not recommend doing this in a solo game unless you're a god or unless you have a dead man walking i would recommend doing this on co-op so that all of your concentration and focus is on the leaking wine barrels there's only going to be a split second delay in between how fast or slow the wine is leaking amongst the barrels but you can easily determine which one's the fastest and which one's the slowest it's just the ones in between that could be a little tricky once again if you do this in the wrong order you're gonna have to restart your game since there's currently no way to restart this process but once you've done that correctly the secret room right over there will be opening up and you could either get silver bullets a random pickup maybe a weapon nothing too special but that is it hope you guys found this helpful this is the clarification on how to open up every single secret room here in dead of the night 100 guaranteed that's about it this is medike dynamite check all links down below in the description and enjoy the secret rooms